hockey player has a new piece of equipment. It's a prosthetic brace and it was created by Milford High School students. Local 12's Megan Mangello shows us how this is a game changer. Gabe, a defenseman on the Miami Junior Red Hawk hockey team, was hitting the puck around in the Milford High School hallway. Connor's one of the students helping the 12 year old from Harrison improve his game. Coming off and then overusing my right side. Gabe Vogelsang was born without fingers on his left hand. He's been managing, but the hockey competition is getting intense. So his mom, Kim, connected with Hands of Hope and Project Lead the Way. So our lives have been so blessed by having a kid as special as Gabe. So we couldn't be more excited and we roll with it. It was meant to be. You know, God makes no mistakes. He was made to be this way and in our house, different is awesome. And what students Emmy and Connor designed is pretty awesome. Gabe's brace was printed right here with this 3D printer. It's called Grip Hand 3 because it took three tries to get it right. So first we uh, thought we'd try something that looked more hand-like so like he could like fit his hand into his hockey glove with a naturally closed uh, design. But that didn't have a good grip. The other prototype would have snapped too easily. So the students designed a ball and socket mount that allows Gabe to better move the stick. We don't know if it's going to break, like if he falls down or like gets into a collision or rough housing, which it's hockey, so something's going to happen to it. Connor says he and the students will continue to perfect the brace. It's great, but like it's like always on this side, so I can't toe drag, but it doesn't really matter because I'm defense. What matters is the help Gabe is getting from some smart students who know the passion he has for playing just like any other kid. Megan Mangello, Local 12 News. That is awesome. The program is through the Great Oaks Career Center, and students get both high school and college credit for taking the class.